twin spar aluminum frame comes with a handful of tweaks for the new generation. First off, the factory sent the structure to fat camp where it dropped 10% from the total weight of the main frame and 38% from the subframe. Next, it shaved just over 3 quarters of an inch, 20 millimeters, off the width of the bone, stretched the swing arm and double of the bracing on same for greater rigidity. The steering head comes set for 23.2 degrees of rake with 3.74 inches of trail over a 55.9 inch wheelbase that makes the Jixxer even more eager in the corners than ever before. Suzuki boosted the front discs by 10 mm up to a total of 320 mm and went with premium Bremble components for both discs and calipers at both ends. Like the R models, the Base 1000 comes with an inertial measurement unit that as its devilishly ingenious name suggests, gauges the forces that work on the machine to help refine the responses of the traction control. Unlike that higher tier model, the GSX-R1000 ABS doesn't get the sexy, corner-sensitive brake control feature, but it does use the axis force readings to prevent rear wheel lift when you grab a fistful of the front brake and interventions are subtle with little pulsing in evidence and only under the firmest braking pressures.